Are you tired of slogging away on the treadmill for hours on end, or are you looking for a more efficient way to burn fat and boost your fitness? Well today we're about to unveil the ultimate showdown between two of the most popular cardio workouts out there. In this video we'll be diving deep into the world of cardio, breaking down the science, and revealing which workout reigns supreme. So if you've ever wondered if you should go all out with high intensity interval training, or maybe opt for a more leisurely stroll with low intensity steady state cardio, you're in the right place. Stay tuned because by the end of this video, you'll have the knowledge you need to make an informed decision that could transform your fitness journey. High Intensity Interval Training HIIT, and Low Intensity Steady State LISS, are two widely recognized approaches to enhancing cardiovascular fitness, each offering distinct methodologies and advantages. 1. Heat, High Intensity Interval Training High Intensity Interval Training HIIT, is characterized by its brevity and high-intensity nature. Heat sessions involve short, vigorous bursts of exercise alternated with brief periods of rest or lower intensity activity, repeated throughout a specified time frame. The benefits of heat are multifaceted, including the ability to burn a substantial number of calories in a condensed period, a heightened metabolic rate, and improved cardiovascular health. However, it's worth noting that heat may not be suitable for everyone, particularly beginners and individuals with specific medical conditions, due to its demanding nature. 2. LIS, Low Intensity Steady State Low Intensity Steady State, LISS, cardio, on the other hand, emphasizes maintaining a steady, moderate intensity level during aerobic exercises over a prolonged period. LIS activities encompass activities such as extended walks, gentle jogs, or leisurely bike rides. LIS workouts are gentle on the body, rendering them accessible to a broader spectrum of fitness levels. They promote endurance development and facilitate fat burning when consistently incorporated into a fitness routine, making them an excellent choice for beginners, those in injury recovery, or anyone seeking a low-impact workout option. 3. Comparing Heat and LIS Let's compare heat and LIS more comprehensively. Calorie Burn Heat burns more calories in a shorter time frame. LIS results in calorie burn too, albeit at a slightly lower rate. Workout Duration Heat sessions are typically short, spanning 20 to 30 minutes. LIS workouts are longer, generally ranging from 45 minutes to an hour. Metabolism boost, heat substantially boosts metabolism, leading to continued calorie expenditure even after the workout. LIS also contributes to metabolic improvement, albeit to a lesser extent. Recovery time, heat necessitates more extended recovery periods due to its intense nature. LIS requires minimal recovery time. 4. Finding the right fit. The key to selecting between heat and list lies in aligning your choice with your fitness objectives, personal preferences, and current fitness level. If your aim is to maximize calorie burn within a shorter time frame and you relish high-intensity workouts, heat is likely the ideal choice. However, if you prefer a more relaxed pace, seek a lower impact option, or are embarking on your fitness journey, list may be the perfect fit. Some individuals opt to incorporate both heat and listen to their fitness routines, capitalizing on the unique advantages of each to attain a well-rounded cardiovascular fitness regimen. Ultimately, the choice between heat and list should harmonize with your individual goals and preferences. There you have it, the epic showdown between heat and list. The truth is, there's no one-size-fits-all answer, and the best cardio workout is the one you enjoy and can stick with. We hope this video has shed some light on the heat versus list debate and helps you make informed choices on your fitness journey. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more fitness content, and share it with your workout buddies. Thanks for joining us today, and remember, the most important thing is to keep moving and stay healthy. Until next time, keep sweating, keep smiling, and keep crushing those fitness goals.